Are we both hitting it? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Right up that hill. That power helps right up that hill. I mean, obviously it's not a problem for the regular Suron too. What's up everyone? Thanks for checking out today's video. Here with Brandon. Trying to make our way to uh, some trails. We're gonna do some comparison of the regular Suron, which Brandon's on, to the XX, which your boy is on. Thanks for clicking on today's video. Having a, I have an update on the battery situation of the Suron. Spoke to Seb over at Luna. First of all, I have to hands hands down, hats off, major compliments, major shout out to Luna Cycles and their customer service. <laughs> Luna's Luna's customer service has been outstanding though. I, I spoke to a customer service rep the first time who gave me that advice that I had in uh, in my initial impressions video about balancing. I've also reached out to Seb over there who's the, the lead technician at Luna. We're doing some more diagnosis on my battery and controller. Checking the voltage at full battery and at empty battery. I'm still in communication with them, so stay subscribed, stay tuned to the channel for the latest updates on that. It's a fluid situation, but the Luna, the Luna customer service team has been very responsive to emails and phone calls. I, I mean, they move a lot of bikes too. They've actually moved the most Surons of any retailer in the entire world. And the fact that they're still able to service them with their ticketing system is pretty outstanding in my book. So hats off to Luna. So these trails that we're going on are a little bit secret. The only details I can really provide is that uh, they're somewhere in South Park. So we're making our way over to South Park area of North Carolina, Charlotte. Apparently there's a lot of construction going on. It's a beautiful day here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Somewhere in the 50s. Gorgeous day. Brandon, let's do an acceleration test. Let's do an acceleration test. Are we both hitting it? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. So there's the acceleration test between the X and the XX. They put you about. So the, the differences between the X and the XX is mostly about the amperage. Everyone gets caught up in the voltage and, and what's what, but it's really about amperage. The XX is pulling 150 to 160 amps. It puts you well ahead of me, but you can tell it leveled off at a point. Like you and I, the distance getting, didn't get greater after, after you initially got your jumps. You can definitely feel at like 40 that it still wants to go, but it's like, governed again you know what i mean like you this, one, this wants us to go left on providence but i think we go straight all right go ahead hyundai gotta watch people people pretty much don't see you 
But yeah, that's an acceleration test for you. I'm not going all out, but we are in them streets. We'll get some trail footage here in a little bit too, to do a little bit more comparison. Stick with me here. Appreciate you checking out today's video. Thanks for likes, for comments. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already. Help support the channel. Also got a new merch shop. Check that link in the description. Working with a great organization called Uncommon. It's here in, uh, here in Charlotte. I'm helping them with a little bit of their merch stuff. So show a little love to Uncommon. Now I do have a chest mount, so depend I, I can't really super control what these angles are gonna look like. But I'll try and edit it as best as I can, folks. Give me a thumbs up if you like some trail riding. Drop a comment, let me know where you like to ride. What you ride in. You ready? Yeah. Here we is. We're on these secret trails. Yeah, I'm gonna try and stay seated, try and get a decent angle for most of this, but I am no professional. This is what makes the Suron fun is the fact that it has no problem going off road. You don't have to worry about, did I hit this jump too hard? Cause I got a hub motor, or is it too heavy in the rear? I mean, it's not the best weighted bike and, and all that stuff, you know, you can't get all the way up on the seat or whatever, but it's still a blast. I don't think you do this on no super. I need to uh, put the upgraded bash plate on this thing. I also don't have any protective gear on, so we're gonna ride this as safe as we can, but still having fun. I'm trying to ride all of them. Little deer path. And this is all with just stock suspension. I, I am gonna be doing some upgrades to this. Definitely stick around the channel. a big drop.
Sometimes the best line is avoiding everything. That little extra push helps you get up those little, those little lips. Going up? Yeah. Down. Got to be careful going over those logs. I don't have the upgraded bash plate. This one's fun. Hmm, right up that hill. That power helps right up that hill. I mean, obviously it's not a problem for the regular Suron too. Stuff's a little bit more technical. Can we just no, just a little trail maintenance. Yeah. Got to give back to the trail. We went here last time. So we're going to go through one more time. Just because. So you can see the the XX has a little more punch, but the regular Suron is not lacking. Kind of pop it out of eco mode there. Get that extra power.
Well, so that's a little glimpse of a uh, Suron X and a Suron XX on the trails. Appreciate you guys checking out today's video. Thanks for dropping likes and positive comments and sticking with me all this time. If you want to help support the channel, strongly consider subscribing if you haven't already. If you have, I appreciate you. I've also got some merch. Check out the description for different gear I'm running. Merch to help support the channel. Appreciate you as the viewer. Thanks again for watching today. Love one another. Always be kind. Peace.